Welcome to Captivate Or Training. My name is Joe Plyme. I'll be guiding you through the training today. This tool allows you to create software demonstrations, simulations, presentations, as well as soft skill applications. Best of all, you don't need any prior code knowledge. It's a very straightforward program. To start the program, we can double click on the icon or click Start programs, find Adobe, then Adobe Captivate 4. Then once we click on that, then we can start to see that Adobe is starting to load. And depending upon the speed of your computer, it takes roughly 10 seconds or so, somewhere around there. Now we can see the Captivate is open. There's several different types of projects that you can do. To record your first project, click Software Simulation. And here, it allows us to directly record an application. Um, with choosing custom size, we can custom size uh, whatever area we'd like to record or we can choose full screen to record the full screen of the computer. Uh, we also have the scenario simulation which basically allows you to create a project from a template or from a PowerPoint presentation. The other option allows you to create a blank project, an image project, uh, image from Microsoft PowerPoint, or create a project from a template. First, we will record a custom size project. So here we're first going to select the custom size project. Then we'll click OK. If you see the little squares, you can drag them. And we can increase the width or the height, whatever we need to do to get it to whatever side we need. Uh, if you prefer, we can also set the width or the height using the boxes to uh, whatever pixel size you'd like. Captivate also allows you um, to create certain preset sizes, which are very common uh, sizes. We have things such as a browser or full screen size, uh, depending upon your monitor as well. Um, so for this one, we're going to select 640 by 480. And now we're going to do our first caption. So we can go into demonstration mode. And this will not include any click boxes. What it's meant to do is really just kind of show you. Uh, go ahead and click record. And then we are going to open up the internet browser. And now everything within the red box is going to be recorded. So we want to be able to resize this window because as you can see it's much larger than the red box itself. So once we get it resized, we can put it inside the little red box. And for this particular example, uh, let's go ahead and type uh, Google in. And then to finish the recording, we're going to click on the icon located in the lower right hand side. Uh, you can see the one that says uh, CP. And then once we do that, we can give a name to the project. So right now we'll go ahead and start to type in that name. And then we can select wherever we'd like it to be. So for this particular project, we're going to go ahead and put it on the desktop. Now, as you can see, these are all the screenshots that Captivate took. And we can go into the edit mode. Uh, we can start to see uh, in detail each of the slides. And this is also where we're, we will end up doing most of our editing and such. Uh, any slides that you don't need as you're reviewing these, you can select the slide, 
then right click the mouse, then select delete slide. Now as you can see, some of the slides don't include click boxes. They only include caption text which, uh, and the highlight box. The highlight box is the little thing in blue and the caption is the white box with the writing. This is the demonstration mode. Uh, this will basically allow us to record a demonstration.